the never hashtag never failing God. Never failing. No matter how it tarries, he never failed. No matter how it delays, he said, wait, wait, wait for it. If you think in your eyes, the miracle is being delayed. He said, wait for it. He said, though you think it tarries, it will not tarry. Though it tarries, it will not tarry. Put your right hand on your chest. The owner just play it as the strings. Don't play anything else. The owner, repeat after me. Of my life. I'm before you tonight. My Lord and my maker. I am before you tonight. The Lord my God. I am before you tonight. The one who mold me. The one who formed me. The one that it pleased. That I'm like him. I'm before you tonight. Do that which only you can do. Change my story for the better. Let me end where? Yes, yes, yes. Say, I believe it. I believe. If you believe him, shout aloud, amen. Yes. In a moment, take your seat. You will rise up in a short while to pray. Psalms 43 and verses 3. And I want you to listen carefully. <clears throat> no movement, please. Psalms 43 and verse 3. Just play the keyboard as string, please. Oh, send out thy light. <laughs> what change story is access to light? What and shame is access to light. You remain in bondage until the day you know Christ has set me free from the law of the spirit. You remain in frustration until the day you discover his word has become my light. You remain frustrated until you discover that there is truly a change of story in your favor. You remain a victim until the day you discovered he was bruised for your sake. And the chastisement of our peace is upon him. That is, he was chastised for me to be peaceful. Peaceful. Not just to have peace, but to be peaceful. What means to be peaceful? Means to have every good thing. The Bible says, I quit not to serve with God and be at peace. He said, then, when you are at peace, he said, thereby, good shall come unto thee. <laughs> Light is all it takes to end darkness. Light is all it takes to end the imagination of the wicked. Light, just Light is all it takes to carry miracle children. Light is all it takes to have a fulfilled home. Light is all it takes to have a fulfilled journey. 
light 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 is all it takes he said oh send out thy light that is send something to me let me know i am entitled for it show me david said give me understanding i will live let me understand that your, the provision of wealth is available in redemption. Let me understand that there is provision of liberty in redemption. Let me understand that there is provision of health. Give me an understanding that the wicked can't touch me. And then he found it. Touch not. My anointed. Give me understanding that the ranting and the chanting of the wicked cannot have effect on my life. Light is all it takes to have the future of your children secured. Light. Light is all it takes to dispel the imaginations of the wicked. The entrance of his word gives light and understanding to the simple. Oh, send out thy light and thy truth, your light. He said, let them lead me. What will direct you to where your fortune are is light. What will bring you before your helper is light, not common sense. What will open the door for you, sir, is light. What will give you a name that your fathers never own is light. What will bring you access before kings is light. What will make you marriable is light. What we make you a wife or a husband is light. It's not money. Not everyone that has money is a good husband. Oh, send out thy light. When he send it your way, sir, everything not working, start working instantly. Instantly. Thank you, Lord Jesus. On the bottles of oil right now, I declare the release of light. Amen. You said this night, if you are going to be saying amen, say it well. If you are going to be praying, say it well. I'm speaking now to everything in your life that seems like confusion. God will send his light. To every phase of your life where you might have been troubled, I speak right now. The light of God will find expression. Light. Take your seat. Light. Light. What distinguish is light. What separate is light. What put ahead is light. Light. Oh, send out thy light. Ah! I miss everything. Lord, we are not asking for anything tonight, but we are asking for access to light. You see, let your light lead me. Let it. Somebody stand on your feet. Lord, Send your light to me. Uh, I want you to be desperate. Let it set to me. Let it lead me. Send your light to me. Lord, send your light. Lord, send your light to me. Let it lead me. Somebody pray. Somebody pray. Come on, pray. 
Lord, send your light to me. Are you praying at all? Are you praying at all? Lord, send your light to me. Lord, send your light to me. <coughs> In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. It says, In 24, by my light. They will gain access to suppers by my light. They will gain access to suppers by light. They will gain access to suppers. It says it is a year of creative and productive instructions. Take note of that. To be void of it. Is to miss the best of life. To be void of it is to miss the best of life. You need light much more for 2024 than you need man. Light will help you identify the right connection. Light will help you identify the right placement. Light. Light. Amaze, hardship and dryness. There will be creative and productive instructions that will give you access to the heart of kings. You need the right word that can pierce through the heart of man is deeper. You need the right word that can pierce through that when you speak it. And you say today, all men listen. I call super hard, all men listen. And you come out like they begin to listen, yes. even to what they believed in, just to bring about your favor. This is your night. Amen. Why don't you lift your two hands and say, Lord, thank you. In a hurry for what you're said to do. Give him praise, give him praise, give him praise, give him praise. <clears throat> Give him praise. Give him praise. Give him praise. <coughs> Give him praise. Give him praise. Let tonight answer according to your divine plan. Breathe on your word, Lord. Let your word produce the desired miracles. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. God bless you comfortably. Take your seat. <clears throat> Tonight is about the making and the beauty of God's Jesus. The making and the beauty of God's Jesus. From last night's teaching, we have an understanding of the chasers of God. But there is need to know how to get enlisted. They are the custodian of heavenly virtue. God's chases are custodians of heavenly virtue. Heavenly virtue. Because whatever is true, whatever is pure, whatever is kind, whatever is loving and lovable, if there be any virtue in it, it's what they think of. 
they are custodians of heavenly virtue. They don't think as ordinary men think. Their desire is not in what ordinary men desire. Their longing is not. David said, as the deer pant forth the waters. Not as man thinks, but as the deer pant forth the water. He said, so my heart, my my heart, not my mind. My heart, the deepest part of it. So long after thee in a dry and thirsty land. That is where nothing is working. All I want to see is you. Everything. Everything. Lord you are. Everything to me, everything, yes, Lord, everything, oh, Lord, you are. Let's take it again two more times. Everything, <laughs> everything. Oh Lord, you are everything to me. Everything, everything, everything. Oh Lord, you are. He is the everything that they see in all things. When pain is about to show up, they're not seeing it. They're seeing him. The Bible says, and the more pressed on, there was a stampede on Stephen. He, he didn't notice them. His eyes was focused on Jesus. This Jesus. This Jesus. Ooh, this Jesus. My savior, the lifter of my head. This Jesus. My help. This Jesus. My breakthrough. This Jesus. <laughs> my hope in heaven. This Jesus. My liberty. This Jesus. My healer. This Jesus. Ooh. <laughs> this Jesus. This Jesus. The making and the beauty of God's Jesus. Anyone can chase God and chase him where? Anyone. Anyone can chase God and chase him where? Anyone. God's plan is that all men come to him. God's plan. And guess what? Every man has access by divine provision. Every man has access. That's why you see that a witch that killed yesterday is used for global revival today. Why? There are no restrictions to assess Christ. Stop limiting a limitless goal. There are no restrictions. There are no if any man <clears throat> confess with his mouth, believed in his heart that Jesus is Lord. He said the same is saved of him. If any man, any man, and the Bible says, whosoever, whosoever, whosoever believe in his name, John 3:16. Whosoever, 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 whoso, whoso, whoever you are, everyone, there is divine provision for every and anyone. I don't know who you are tonight and I don't know what the devil is telling you but I'm telling you, you can bet a new you. The, the, the real giant or the 
ordained by God can come out of you tonight. In fact, he is most interested in the worst of men. He is most interested in the worst of men. He, no matter how worst your life as I know they are aware of your horribleness. I know they are aware of your shortcoming. In fact, they know everything about you. I'm speaking tonight. God is changing your story. Somebody shouted tonight. It is the making of kings. Take your seat. Where you are seated, there are four major elements. The wind, the water, fire, and the earth. And I'm speaking to these four elements. Antakido kotofra hatika bira sakalo kotobretia I speak to the water. I speak to the earth. I speak to wind. And I speak to fire. It will answer in your favor. <laughs> Hello, sir. Hello, sir. With all of my heart, what I saw in redemption, what I have seen in light, I ask God to grant you access <laughs> in whatsoever nation you are listening to me tonight your struggles have come to an end your struggles have come to an end <laughs> when I speak to water I'm talking of any man that made use of water they will walk in your favor. When I speak to the heart, I'm speaking about everything that creepeth, walketh on the surface of the heart. It will answer in your favor. When I speak to the wind, I'm talking about everything the wind can touch. The wind will answer in your favor. When I speak with fire, I'm talking about what it can touch, what it can consume. And I speak tonight, the fire of the Holy Ghost we answer in your favor. Somebody say it three times. Tonight is my night. Take your seat. The making and the beauty. There is a making process and there is what follows. And that's the beauty. There is a making process. And there is what follows. That's the beauty. I know the thoughts. I know nobody is thinking for me. No. When it comes to a Dayton's case, nobody is thinking for me. I know the thoughts. I will not ask any man, neither will I take permission from any, what we have on the schedule today to do for her. No. I know, meaning I am aware of what to do with her life. No one formed her. I formed her. No one has an understanding of the future of Ebenezer. They slept with him. They are by his side. They walk with him. They thought they have a glimpse. I am the God that overturn and overturn and overturn until I bring it to the right of whom it belongs. And I, the Lord, speaks in my mightiness that tonight is your night. Tonight.
Tonight is your night. Tonight is your night. Matthew chapter 4 and verse 18. Matthew 4 and verses 18. Anyone that chase God and can truly chase him well. Jesus met this young man. The Bible says, and Jesus walking by the Sea of Galilee, we're going through 20. He saw two brothers. Simon called Peter and Andrew his brother. So Simon and Andrew. They were the first he saw. The Bible says, casting a net into the sea, for they were fishermen. Until you are chosen, everything you are doing remain but in frustration. The same thing you've been doing, nothing is coming. Somebody just come there, did foolish thing. Even you know that you are the smartest of them all. But nothing is speaking. Hello, sir. Nothing is working because you are hard working. You know, it is not hard work that takes men far. It's not. We don't have any special carcass where we pray for financial provision. Never. We've never had such a meeting. Never. The Bible speaking in Romans 8 40. If the spirit, Romans 8, 11, if the spirit of him, the spirit of him that raised Jesus from the dead, the spirit, you know what Jesus said? He got to the fig tree. He said, how come you don't have fruit? You know what? The Bible said it was not the season at time. He said, we are not discussing the season at time. We are discussing about the Lord of the season. When the Lord of the season appear every time is a season. Every time is a season. It's a, it's a, we don't need it. But as long as we need it, that's the right time. And there's nothing I said, eh, we know we need this, but we can't have it now. Everything is... He said, no. Nothing is tough when we need it. Bet the spirit. Bet the spirit. Nothing is tough when you need it. Bet the spirit. Let it enter you now. Nothing is tough when you need it. And no, nothing is tough when you need it. Victor, nothing is tough when you need it. Ebenezer, nothing is tough. Dishi, nothing is tough when you need it. Victor, nothing is tough when you need it. Busala, nothing is tough when you need it. Nothing. Hario, nothing is tough when you need it. Nothing. Nothing. The Bible says, for they were fishermen, and he said unto them, take your seats, sirs. follow me. The word was simple. Follow me. Follow me. And I will make you fishers of men. Follow me. Follow me. The kind of wealth transfer that is coming, labor can give it. Would labor have been able to take you, being that to Mauritius? You entered this church, your salary was less than 25,000 here. And Benga will come and be telling me, we've gone for matter. You know, and they take him to governors of a different government, nothing to govern. How long are you going to continue in this? When God enters a man's race, he becomes grace. He becomes grace. Have you asked yourself why when you want to buy a shoe, they say there is shoe line in Wuse Market? And you ask yourself, is everybody selling? If they are not selling, they won't open shop every day. There is a God that said to each man, each man, each man, 
Everybody can fly at the same time without touching themselves. You can fly. There is nothing to envy in your neighbor. The grace that is coming on you now is the grace to have it when you need it. You just got it. Ooh, ooh. Come and jump on your feet and celebrate this victory. Somebody shout it three times. I have it. Take your seat. Grace to have it when you need it. So they step into it. They began following. And guess what? The miracle takes place the moment you start following. Master, before you came, we have toyed all through the night and we caught nothing. He said, nevertheless, at thy word, he is there at thy word. And there was what? A net breaking miracle. The moment they switch to chasing him. How does this making take place? Second Chronicles chapter 7. I will show you in blueprint as he has delivered it. And I pray right now that every heart be sanctified Amen. to receive this divine blueprint. Amen. I pray tonight that every moving spirit be silenced. He said, be still and know that I'm God. It is in stillness that he is revealed. In the secret, in the quiet place, in the stillness you are there. So the best of heaven is made manifest in active following. If you verify an account and if it's a verifiable one, it will show active. And if it's dormant, you will say it is dormant. Second Chronicles chapter 7 and verse 14. If my people who are called by my name, number one, on the making, be enlisted by his name. Are you following me right now? Be enlisted. They must attach his name to your name. Oluwa Bright. Oluwa Magada. Are you following me right now? They must attach his name to your name. You must have found a place in his name. <laughs> you must have found a place. You must have hid your name in his name. That every time they mention and before they say Drew, the Jesus shows up face. That's why you see there are some people when you call their name in the evil covenant, Jesus shows up before you even finish the chanting. And when he shows up, thunder is showing up. <laughs> Ooh. If my people that are called 
by my name. It is an individual thing. Lord, let me answer your name. <laughs> you don't understand. Lord, let me answer your name. Give me a name that is yours. And then look at you. Say, from today I give you goodness. He look at you. And then he said, I sworn by my name, you will be called favor. That no matter what, favor. That's the first thing. In the making, there must be an attachment with the name. You must understand the name than anything else. Sometimes we joke about it in my house. At everything, my wife just shout Jesus, Jesus. I say, you're wasting his name. Smart him, hey, Jesus. Talk to Jesus. But I know that she has just soaked her life in that name. I told her when we met, the first time she had me pray, she was shaking. How can somebody pray like this? I said, if you are scared of stepping on their toes, they will step on you forever. That's the day she caught the fire. It's me that will be telling her, cool down this prayer now. She caught it once. And get enlisted once. Somebody pray where you are seated. Lord, let me answer your name. Open your mouth. Pray. Pray that prayer. Let me answer your name. Let my offspring answer your name. Let everything my life represent answer your name. Ario, pray. Ebenezer, pray. Let my future answer your name. When they look for me, let them see your name. Let Oluwateniola answer your name. Oluwa for lodging me. Oluwa loaning me. Oluwa anati. Oluwa busola. Oluwa femi. Let my household answer your name. Somebody pray. There is a seed of greatness inside of me. Let it answer your name. There is a future inside of me. Let it answer your name. There is a tomorrow inside of me. Let it answer your name. Victor, pray. <laughs> There is a tomorrow inside of me. Let it answer your name. Let my face answer your name. Let my proposal answer your name. Let my business answer your name. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Take your seat. You know, we children of God, we don't understand the power in that name. But you see, those who are lost to the devil, they have an understanding of it. That's why you hear, Ogolu Abiapalo, the glory of God, Biapalo. Are you following me right now? Somebody who is making concussion, just to charm. To sell Amala. Oluwa fi follow Amala joint. They attach. They, they are conscious. The Baba will tell you. I've done my own. That is. The God of the heaven. Will help you. 
are making is in the name, sir. It's in the name. When you answer his name, that demon that says, Jesus, I know. Paul, I know who you be. He wants to know if there is an authority. There is a transference of authority. When you answer his name, everything answers. Can I speak over these children? In 2024, you'll be a thousand times better. <laughs> I am speaking about your life. I am declaring on your life in 2024. You'll be a thousand times better. Now listen. In 2024, you will have promotion 12 times. There, there, there's somebody here in 2024. There is a listen, it, there is one individual that will recommend you to top authority. Listen, listen. They are they, take, take note of it. I can see the picture right now. They recommend you to top authority. The person left your organization, got promoted, he got an appointment then recommend you. There is just a, a recommendation that causes commotion. Listen. There is a recommendation that causes commotion in the office. In 2024, you will be promoted 12 times. There is a voice that changes Story suddenly. That voice is coming forth now. Receive a change of story. Receive a change of story. If you are conscious, it is yours now. By the authority. In the name of Jesus, walk in dominion <laughs> by the authority of the name of Jesus. Walk in power. Take your seat. So it begins by getting enlisted with his name. Number two. The making. If my people that are called by my name, there's a comma there, and he say, Sha, humble themselves. Number two, humble yourself. It does not rest on the pride. Pride is a disrupting force. This grace does not follow the proud. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, this grace. Yes, yes. Take note of this and watch my journey. It's in a short while. If you look at the story of God's servant, the Apostle Selma, nobody was hearing of him four years ago, but he's been there the last 20 years. There is an announcing time and there is a preparing time. There was a phase all that could happen to Elisha was for a clock to rest on him. There is a submitting phase and he needed to just but follow easily. Many are in a hurry to be called apostle prophet. If you are called a prophet, it will show. It's not in noise. It's not in self-naming. It is not in self-naming. If he is called by God, if God speaks through him, God will confirm his word through him. If God speaks through him, God will back his word. God's word is not man's word. It's not. No. 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 It answered 
to humility of heart. We have a standard which we follow. And our standard is Jesus Christ. Jesus, our standard, was humble to a fault. He was a man of humility. Let me show you a secret about him. With so much power, so much grace, they needed to pay someone to identify who is Christ. Every time Benga, Femi, Bright are moving together with Jesus Christ, every one of them looked alike. So much humility of grace, they could see the same grace by humility at work in Benga. That is reflecting on Femi. The same is reflecting on Danny. Same grace, same virtue. Not in noise. He never answers to noise making. This producing, ever producing grace, ever working grace, is not in noise. It's not in having 17 cars. Having 21 senators as friends. No. It's not a noise. It's a deposit. It comes by impartation and it only rests on the humble. The Bible says, humble thyself under the mighty hand of God. So if my people that are called the making, the, just imagine the professional fisherman of many years called Peter. And some, he has become a doctor of fishery. And somebody just told him, follow me. It takes humility to answer a divine call. He want to put real money inside your hand in 2024. It will only answer to humility. There is a $10,000 that will enter your head. It runs you mad. And then God said, look at the one we have planned to handle a billion dollars. By agenda. Ah! You just call Michael Gabriel. What happened to somebody we have a plan to give a billion dollars to? And $10,000 scatter his head. He said, we revisit him and send him to a rehabilitative home. With what? With his level, should not pass more than one dollar. So everywhere he goes, the, the, what they will put in his hand is one dollar. He will never have a grace to undo even ten dollar. Pride can reduce greatness to nothing. Twenty twenty four. The humility at heart, we sit at the height of greatness. Humility, we open great doors. It just first doors open for you. Everybody's just liking your character. Humility. Everybody has something good to say about you. Humility. You are not full of self. You are just humble. It doesn't make you stupid. It ends you more. Humility. If my people that I call my name shall humble themselves. Humble themselves. Humility precedes answers. It is the gateway to a lasting victory. It is the gateway to a lasting victory. I told my dad, I've seen somebody I want to marry. So, and you know the way I said Alero, Alero. So I went to him and said, I found Alero to marry. He said, ah, God is not in that name. God is not with her. That one, that particular one is not the person. So I went back two days after. I said, okay, I found Busola. He said, yes, I perceive God is with her. <laughs> I brought Busola. Busola knelt down. And while Busola was to stand up, I just said, Alero, come this way. He said, but there's no Alero on this side. I said, see Alero. You didn't see where. Humility pave way for the blessing instantly. Instantly, my grandma of blessed memory. When, as at the time I was talking to my wife, my grandma was 119, 
and I took my wife. You know, she lives in a hut. You know, you meet girl now. You can't even take them to where your parents are, not talk of your grandma. Are you following me right now? The only way she can preserve her meat, her fish, is to put it inside that net and get up. Because even in her house, plenty rats are living with her. And yet, she got there. I didn't need to tell her what to do. Just tidy this old woman's room. And the more you tidy it, the more the woman will turn it back because they like their rags. He said, no matter how you think you have clothes, you can have so much rags like the aged. Just small stupid babe following you up and down. Not allowing you to see future. Ah, your mate they live here. No. Don't bring me here. And if you can't bring her to the Lungu, how do you take her to the village where your mama stay? If they are not humble, let her go. The beautiful ones are not yet born. That means you've not even seen. When you think you have seen finish, it's just the beginning of the journey. Wake up. True power is not a noise making. Exhortation is wrapped up in humility. Exhortation is wrapped up in humility. First Peter chapter 5 and verse 6. Humble yourself therefore under the mighty hand. The mighty hand. Every time you hear the word hand. You know, if hands will even come on you, it requires what? You know, if, you, if somebody want to pray for you now, it will just start praying. And you're standing, you will just start praying. But the moment you go down, what happened? He stretched forth. And then you know what? The word going down means submission. And there is no way you submit without receiving. A wife that submits to the husband will get the best of him. No matter what is happening outside, he's in a hurry to go home. He knows that's the woman who submit peace to me. She submit peace of mind. She submit joy. Humility is key. Number three. If my people that are called by my name shall humble themselves and pray and seek my face. Number three. You must be prayerful and learn to seek God always. The revelation of yesterday is not enough, sir. The devil has upgraded. He doesn't appear with on again now. He appears with addiction, social media addictions. He takes all of your time while others are thinking. He push you there. He introduces whatever is trending to you. That's what you wake up with. He takes discipline to say, Lord, help me. Lord, help me. You must pray without ceasing. First Thessalonians 5, 17. Pray without ceasing. If they shall humble and pray, prayerful men will never complain in 2024. If you see a man complaining around you, just know that you have found a man who is not praying. 2024, men will bring heaven on heart. I'm talking about raw, 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 raw. They will bring heaven on heart. Listen carefully. One of the thriving resources of 2024 is land banking. You will make so much from land. When God gives you money, even if it's in the forest, buy it. You will save a fortune through land in 2024. Plenty people buy hunger. We want to sell their land. Buy it. Open your two hands. May God put money in your hand. I'm speaking now by the authority of the name Jesus. 
May God put money in your hand. I decree by the authority of the name Jesus. May God put money in your hands. I speak now. Money to be in control. To be in charge. May God put money in your hands. Take your seat. There is a measure of height you can never get except you pray. It was simple. Lord, I can't go through a journey of frustration as a servant of God. My own was simple. Lord, in the place of prayer, what must I do not to beg bread? I don't want to look at your offering box. What must I do to be ahead? No. I don't want to tell your church there is a project of one million naira, and I'm looking for who will help God. And not in this ministry. Not in this ministry. Not in this. You can't send me something now and tell me we are supporting God. I will curse you. You can't support God. You can There is no matter that can God does not need support. You are the one who needs it. You can't support God. A seed is a seed to secure your future. No seed is strong enough. In fact, any seed that is trying to support God is a cause. If at this height, God is still begging you to tight, you don't know. That the devil only fights what has secret inside. If the tithe was empty, it wouldn't be a fighting thing. There is a spirit behind it. That's why the blasted bastard is angry about it. It is wisdom to know that the one who brought what you are holding, literally, initially, is God. What of if he didn't bring it? It is now foolishness to be holding on so much to it. There are people who have never tied anything this year. And since you didn't tie it, did the church ask you? Did the work of God stop? If everybody stopped giving, the work of God will continue. Your giving is not an input. It's just a privilege for your lifting. A privilege. I'm your pastor. My turnover this year in business is over 120 million this year alone. That is, I am not lazy. I put my hands to work. And 90% of it goes on the project going on without noise. Wake up, man. Wake up. I, I don't think it. I don't think money. It's not part of my reason. I not even for family affair. Not, I don't think it. I pray about everything. I don't think everything. Grab the future, Benga, that is sweeter and better than what I've seen is made possible in your life. Pray for about it. You can have it, Lord. This children coming will not be sickless that we have to be rushing to us beautiful. No. I didn't have to pray that prayer twice. These children coming will not be deformed. I didn't have. He said you will speak to my hearing and I the Lord will hasten to perform. I have a future in Christ. Against all odds. Against the report of the wicked. I am the voice, the cornerstone of, of my father's house. I am the pathfinder of the kind of ways that has not been known in the history of Ojo's family. I found it in the scripture. Thou shalt have whatsoever you say. I said it to the hearing of God and I'm working on it. I told God I am the light when I see the light. You can become whatever 
you want to become when you pray about it to God. Tell him everything, but don't nurse everything. Pray is the making process. Because when men, men that pray always recognize they don't have any other help but him. They don't have any other person but him. Pray about everything. About everything. My wife told me, how they just said there's kidneys too. I said, not in the house. I didn't say it twice. Not in the house. And it is of itself. What you nurse grow. You nurse it, it grow. You start nursing emotion now foolishly, it will grow. It will grow. If you nurse a spiritual encounter, you will have it. It just takes time. You are nursing it, you will have it. You are nursing power. Power will come. Power will come. Power will come. Power will come. My brother was telling me, hey, don't let this person know. I said, about what? I said, don't let this person know. I want to travel. I just went back straight. I said, tell him. He said, I should not tell you that he's traveling. He's traveling now. He's tra you know what? Power is an intermediary. Power is talking. And so, so, so tell him, he shall be well with him. And what said, that's how whatsoever you say. Say it now. Say it. Or else, in your lifetime, you will witness it and you won't see the proceed. Say it now. I said, you now. So use your mouth now. Tell him. Say, since you said that the Nikin saw, since as you say it, I'm traveling. <laughs> Whichever way, tell them. Power is not enough. That's why you forget. That's why you're scared. If they hear of it, they will kill me. If they hear of it, they will kill me. Uluwa, Enyilo, Tosi, Baba, Enyilo, Tosi. Kotosi and what I mean. Uluwa, Enyilo, Tosi, Latiba, Obogo. You deserve the glory and the honor. Lord, I lift my hands as I bless your holy name. You are the glory and the honor. So I lift my hands in worship. As I bless your holy, then I say, Lord, for you are God. <laughs> You're the miracle so great. There is no one else like you. There is no one else like Thank you, take your seat. You must be ready to pray and to seek his face. See, don't just jump into that business. Lord, what are you saying about it? Don't, no matter how you try to paint it, you can't, you can't meet me on the road now. Paint something, bring him money. Godliness with contentment is great. Key. I must ask him to know if there is a, there is no scheme, there is no how you tell me that would make one of my core value. I never invest on anything I don't have at least 95% control over. That's my first. I'm not looking for what is not. I'm not looking for it quickly, not MMM. You know, whatever is not demanding a tax from my brain, I'm not involved. There, there is no how you try to tell me. You see, there is this supply business, there is this store. Forget it. I like it buying and say, I bought it and I sell it. I'm okay with it. Whatsoever your hands find, there is a location. That is what your hand locate, not what they try to frame for you. 
If your hands find hair dressing, do it with dignity. Your hands find selling toothpick chewing stick. Even the rich will park by your roadside and buy it. If he has blessed you to sell Akara, dress smartly. They will pack there and buy it. He said, do it with all of your heart. There is dignity in labor. Number four. If my people that are called by my name shall humble themselves and pray, he says what? I will hear. And I will forgive their sins. Number four, abandon and eliminate evil. You must abandon and eliminate evil in your life. And this is how it starts. You must end any and everything that makes you think you are better than everybody. That's the first evil you must kill. Any and everything that tells you, why would she be the one marrying? I'm supposed to be beside that guy. I'm better than us. You know, even far. I slay, man. Your slay no get you married. Are you following me right now? You must know everything we get in life is given. And so it takes grace to assess some things. So whatever makes you think you are better, bury it. You must end evil. End lustfulness. Some things we never speak. End drunkenness. Little sipping. <laughs> Pastor, no there. Pastor, no there. Nobody did. You must end anything you do comfortably in the secret is a destroyer. That is, you are not proud of it in the open. It will ruin the journey of 2024. It will, it will put you in perpetual penury. He said, the prince of this world came and found nothing of ease in me. Give him no room whereby he says, what you have in your hand, I give it. Have you considered my servant, Job? God must be able to address you as his servant. Don't be initiator of evil. Don't be initiator of evil. Don't, don't. I told you about, about a few years ago, I said to you that the backyard, the back door always leads to the backyard. Have you ever seen a back door that takes you to the front? It's always to the backyard. Every cutting corner is the, you are not great that way. And you think because you came to church, you brought this, I brought a special offering from stealing. God has opened heaven. God has not opened anything. God didn't accept it. It's a cost sacrifice. In fact, it is better not to drop it. Dropping it makes it cost sacrifice. You just get a list of the Lord. See the evidence of my stealing. <laughs> and God said, now we know. There is an emblem. There is a seal. No. We don't make it in this kingdom by cunningness. David said, if it cost me nothing, if you just fly and come, I can't tell how it comes. He said, I can't offer it to the Lord. I must offer the Lord that which is only unacceptable. This journey is sweet, man. It's sweet. I said to my wife, I will release you to the future. When you look at me, you see the future. You see a better tomorrow. There is nothing now, but there is so much in the future. So just follow it. Thy walls were found. I did eat them. Eat them. It is in the heating. It became the joy. 
And suddenly it became the rejoicing. The first verse was joy. The second verse was rejoicing. Joy, rejoicing. Joy, rejoicing of a heart. It's not glorious now, but there is a glorious tomorrow. Don't be in a hurry. Run your race and eat evil. Don't push your husband. Don't, don't tell your husband. Not be men like you. They do this for their wife. You, you know, get shame. If men like that, they do. There are women like you that wakes up in the morning and just give their husband first class ticket. First class ticket. There are women that just say to their husband, I don't want you to work this year. The man is not lazy. They just tell him, you're not working this year. I give you one year salary. And so wake up as a real woman. Is that, is that a crime? That tells you not to wake up. As a real woman. As a, is that, is that, my husband, I'm real woman. Real woman. I send a video to my wife sometimes. A woman woke her husband up and brought every money. So I send it to her so that she can bring me every money. But I'm still waiting for the oil money. I never see Wake up and be that you can be the real woman. Be the voice. Be the extension of light. Are you following me right now? But that does not mean we should raise dummies as a man. Boys who still sleep on the bed 2 p.m. You call them their sleep. Say, I just want to sleep small. My body just wake me. I felt like, you know, I felt. But I say, a little sleep. It's a social poverty come. It's traceable to. My ask her. I didn't get home till it was 10.45. 2, 2 a.m. She still turned. And say, please sleep. You're not sleeping. I say, I'm okay. I'm okay. There is no time, sir. There are direct debit that comes for the security of the children on my account. Insurance will come. They will take local international insurance will come every month. Direct debit. Do you know what it is like when they, those things, money is supposed to go and the money is not going? Eh, it's not for those who are sleeping. There is security. From when I had a better understanding, I prepared for the burial of my father. From when I had a better on, not that I wish him dead. I want him to live so long. I sent him good money. Good money. Not good money. I'm talking of good M-O-N-E-Y. Enjoy your life. And live in good health. But you can't wake me up now and say, hey, something just suddenly happened. And I'm putting my hand on my head. They said, no. From that first day, I start painting the community. A king has gone home. It's, it's not in bad news. There is an insurance to take care of his ending days. I started it early. If insurance here, that's what happened to my father now. They will first of all give me at least 50 million. Just a year. Wake up! There is something you can do rather than you are looking for who to make contribution. One berry, Papa. You can secure it now. With long life, will I satisfy him? I have everything ready made for my passing to glory. It, nothing comes in glory. The wise man is always ready. I don't want my children to be stray, to be on the street. There is a divine provision. You see, this church is God's property and God's own. There is no inheritance of it on my children. It's just God's own. You must live it well now. Wake up, sir. End evil. Turn your back at evil things. Evil things. Evil things. Wishing others evil. If you don't know how to celebrate good news, you can't attract one. Somebody sharing testimony. See, you can, yeah, yeah. Now only she. What did she want to say? Nothing happened. That one a testimony. Hello. You can never have it. The next time you're coming to give testimony, come smiling. Ooh. 
Tell them, man, I don't, my name is Victor Umbo. I don't come again. Are you following me? Quickly, the beauty. I rush this and I give it to you. Number one. The beauty, when you become the chaser of God, the first thing you get is long life. Because God one is the first thing. He enlists longevity on you. Psalms 91 and verse 16. With long life will I satisfy. Can't you see my body boy? Ooh, full of life and energy. Every time you are running a divine mandate, it sustains your life. They are never scared of death. Imagine you are scared of death now. Never. Assignment secure longevity. The reason I can't be scared of anything killing me now, I'm running a divine agenda. That's the first thing you get. The first beauty. They don't pray for long life. I said it coming to my wife. Lord, let her never witness me lay my back on the sick bed. Never. Let her not be opportune to tell me, honey, well, eh? He said, what to him who cannot provide for his household, including health, health, health. You must be able to say, my head, when it's time to go, I will tell her, lay the bed. There is time. It's time. I've done my best. And I drink cold water. And I bless my children. That's how I will end it. I went with clear instructions. No confusion in my days. No confusion. No confusion. And not after that, they're looking for a succession. No. There is a guideline to succession. The right principle. Everything followed in my lifetime. Things properly done. The first beauty you get is the gift of longevity. Number two. Wealth and riches. Psalms 112 and verse 3. The Bible says, Wealth and riches shall be in his house. Wealth and riches. Psalms 112 and verse 3. Verse 3. Wealth and riches shall be in his house and his righteousness endures forever. They, they don't struggle for wealth. They assess it by covenant. By con they, they have an understanding that every seed they lay at the altar of sacrifice is to God. They say, this is what I will do for them. Wealth and riches shall be in his house. Wealth and riches. Wealth and riches, wealth and riches, wealth and riches shall be in his heart. Man, I'm loving this time. The word called our time. I'm telling you, I'm loving this time. The word called our time. You don't know how many times I've traveled out this year and how much is flight ticket. I'm, I'm lo poor men travel like that. And I've not made a journey for self, self gain. No. Say, let me just go, go rest. Walking one. Ever walking. Man, this journey with Christ is sweet, man. It's sweet. It's sweet. It's sweet. Your heart, your heart. If you must lay anything down, lay it by covenant. Lord, it is as unto the Lord. He said, wealth and riches shall be in his house. Wealth and riches shall be in his house. He said, last year we were tenant. By covenant, she made this crazy switch. Lord, this year we're entering our own house. And they got enlisted as landowners. Whatever you can give, you can take. And if it is too big for God, and then his blessing will be too big for you. You must purpose in your heart 
when it comes to seed giving, I offered my best unto the Lord. Let every man do according to what he's capable of. Do not say, I will do this, and you're not fulfilling it. Run a race and meet up with it. Catch up with it. He said, try me and see if I will not open the windows of heaven. And you want to try to think for God. Do not be, don't be analytical. Don't be calculative. He's past finding. His ways is past finding. He passed waiting you feel fine. Don't try to search out God's ways. Open your heart and assess his very best. Number three, beauty. Their increase transcends generation. It is for them and their children. I love this one. The increase that come on the God Jesus is for them and their children. The Bible speaking in Psalm 115 and verse 14 to 15. Psalm 115 verse 14. He said, the Lord shall increase you more and more. There is an increase called more and more. Have I your stand up? Whatever is called greatness that I undo in 2023, a thousandfold of it, may God put it in your hands. Bira, basata, bakuda, a dimension of wealth and prosperity. May God put it in your life. A dimension of wealth and prosperity. May God put it in your hands. It says, the Lord shall increase you more. And more. He said, you and your children and your children's children. Stand on your feet. You and your children and your children's children. Lord, let me have your hand on me. This thing starts with his hand. Lord, are you ready to pray at all? Let me have your hand on me. Come and pray. Lord, let me have your hand on me. Make me your chaser. Let me have your hand on me. Let me have it on my children. Let me have it on my documents. Let me have it on my business. Lord, let me. Somebody pray. I beg you, pray. You can have a change of story. I beg you, pray. Play the strings high. Let me have your hand on me. Somebody pray. Come and open your mouth now and pray. There is an outpouring. Pray, pray. There is an outpouring. Pray, 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 pray. There is an outpouring. Somebody please pray. Pray. Let me have your hand on me. Somebody pray. Take it now. Take it. Take it. Take it. Lord, let me have your hand on me. My God, let me have your hand on me. Jesus, let me have your hand on me. Let me have your hand on me. Somebody pray. I want you to pray. It's you and your God. It's you and your God. Let me have your hand on me. Lord, let 2024 give me all I'm looking for. Lord, let 2024 Give me all I'm looking for. Let me have your hand on me. Somebody pray. Come on, pray. Yes, yes, yes. Talk to God. Those who chase God are praying men.
in Jesus mightiest name we have prayed you know one of the cheap things you guys heard was that there was a pastor who just came suddenly and said to you guys that tomorrow we will take off this tent you know no tent was taken off suddenly you remember we spent 14 days moving around the entire tent and praying we move around the whole village. We were doing blood of sprinkling. Telling God, when we lift the tent, nothing must be able to stop us. We did blood of sprinkling in the day and in the night. You don't know this church is directly proportional to mortuary. A very ground. And we kill forces. Forces that could contend with what God is about to do. Forces that does not want anything to grow. Anything. You see the church beside us. Took them 14 years to stand. 14 years. 14, they be, I, I asked for story. It was built the first time. Finished building. They collapsed it. The highest height of wickedness. I went on my knee to chain principality. I chain principalities. When I ask you to pray, I know what I'm saying. Pray! 2024 shall be a subject to you. Somebody said, my father, make 2024 better. Make it better in my home, in my life, in my family. Pray! Come on, pray! In Jesus, mighty name we have prayed. You know, God was precise. He said, pray and then what? Seek my face. Pray for what you want and then go for it. Ask him, is this the one? Don't just pray, fold hands. Are you following me right now? Don't. You want a miracle land. Be around people that say land. Just be around them. Before you know what happened, you will get one. Be what? Around them. Just be what? Around them. Be what? Around them. And you get it. It was land I market to Pastor Benga. Land. Land. I could so far. Because I called you. I, I show you the secret in the land. And told you how juicy to be. Yes. And then, you know, I flash you the money. Yes. I to be. And then you caught the spirit. When you now brought him, I finished the deed. Yes. Mm. And he's still selling land. Hey. He's still selling land for God. Yes. Taking over land and territory. When you want it, that's praying. You go for it. That's seeking his face. Are you for you don't fold down? Then go for it. Imagine him not making a move, saying, saying Asokoro is too big. I told you guys we came in here, and then the brother was driving me around. He said, You know, since you didn't come with money from your brother, we go there are places we cut it according to our codes. And then you know, I'm seeing all the big place he drove me from. The old, you know, and they drove me past who said to drove me enter Asokoro. Drove me past Asokoro. And he's going to he, he took me to Kojikoi. The next thing is to enter Pape, uh, to enter um, Peggy. You know, after Jikoi is Peggy. 
And after Peggy screwed it, I said, wait. Drop me here. I'm going back. It's Wussy too. Wussy too. Ayakaba. Hello, sir. Open your hands now. Don't pray in here. You will have it. You don't get it. You will have it. No, no. In the name of Jesus. Receive it. In the name of Jesus. Receive. Receive it. What you have been looking for. What you have been struggling to get. Receive it. Hey. There is an anointing on me now. Aya. 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 Meko. Oh God. Of supernatural access. Oh God. Of supernatural access. The God. That bet supernatural access. I stand on the grace behind the supernatural access. What you are looking for, receive. What you are looking for, receive. Hey, what you are looking for, receive. What you are believing God for, receive. Let the power of God come on your mantle. Let the power of God come on your life. Let the power of God come on your mantle. Let the power of God come on your life. Let the power of God enter your bottle of oil. Let the power of God enter your bottle of oil. Let the power of God enter your bottle of oil. Let the anointing of God speak on your life. In the name of Jesus. If you believe it, shout the Lord Amen three times. Now listen carefully. Tomorrow morning is the anointing service. The reason why we're just, what you're doing now is deposit. Deposit of the life-giving spirit. The raw working power. Tomorrow morning, God will be dissolving diseases. Amen. He will, one of the things that will happen tomorrow, He will dissolve discomforts. Amen. Whatever is discomforting you in your body. It's an anointing. Don't come here borrowing oil. He said to the woman, prepare everything in your house. He said, you can borrow barrel, don't borrow oil. You can borrow barrel, don't borrow oil. The anointing is the increasing, the ever increasing anointing. One of the things he does, when you chase God, one of the things he does for you, you seamlessly command victory. That is, you're not praying to be victorious, you walk into it. You do what? You walk into it. You walk into it. You walk into it. You walk into it. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Your best days are here. I want you to go and tell five people my best days are here. Can you give him praise, he's worthy.